Welcome to another episode of Ask a Swim Pro Show. We are in Istanbul, Turkey, and I'm joined by a special guest, Max from My hey. Swim Pro. How are you? I'm great. How are you? I'm, I'm doing well. So we have the Bosphorus behind us. Uh, so maybe what, what, what happened today uh, behind us in the Bosphorus? Oh, it's a lot of people and watching the race and it's yeah. really exciting. How, how was the race? Oh, it was impressed me and I would like join the race next year. Yes, yes, you can do it. So I, I swam the race today and it's a six and a half kilometers in the Bosphorus. And I definitely think you should do it yeah, uh, absolutely. next year, next year. Um, and a lot of people swim at different ages, uh, younger and older. Tell me about your swimming. Like, when did you get started in swimming? Tell me about it. Okay, I firstly started my swimming with uh, was I was a kid, uh, eight, eight years old. And I remember we had a swimming pool behind our apartment. And our parents decided to try, uh, to me and my brother, to mm -hmm. try swimming. And we immediately fell in love in swimming and hit the pool two times a day uh, all our school life and uh, and right now I understand it. it was really cool because we had like goals competitions mm -hmm. and uh, some special community of people who like swimming and do it every day mm -hmm. super cool yeah and unfortunately I stopped my uh, workouts when I uh, started uh, studying at mm -hmm. university because I've dived headlong with my studying mm -hmm. so and I'm back right now actually not right now when uh, the Apple released mm -hmm. Apple released uh, first Apple watch yeah not first second series two yeah Apple watch series two yeah and I started my own app for mm -hmm. swimmers yeah, yeah so you said you were swimming for two hours every day uh, with your brother? Yeah, two times a day. Two times a day. And yeah, it was like two hours. Wow. Uh, and so now how much do you swim? Uh, 30 minutes. 30 minutes? But how many times per week? Uh, two, three times I try. Yeah, that's great. That's great. And uh, so you picked up swimming a couple of years ago. You made the swimming app. And now you're on the My Swim Pro team. Yeah. <laughs> welcome, welcome. So what, what's it been like uh, working on the My Swim Pro team? And what do you do? <laughs> I'm. Uh, I'm software engineer and uh, at my swim pro I'm iOS uh, engineer and I'm working on everything you see in iOS application and I really like the fact uh, that uh, the app we are doing it really helps people mm -hmm. and I love swimming I love technologies and it's it's the best for me to connect everything I love and doing the best yeah yeah, and and tell me about it's not just the iPhone app, but also the Apple Watch app, yeah. right? So, what what's your favorite features are on the product iPhone, Apple Watch, either that you've been able to work on? Uh, let me think. I think it's uh, challenge achievements because uh, it's a big part I particip participated in, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and I'm pretty sure it's really a cool feature. It, yeah, it will motivate mm -hmm. people to achieve their goals. And I've done a lot of engineering stuff, but it's mm -hmm. uh, difficult to explain yeah. to people who are not yeah. familiar with sure. programming. Uh -huh. So what's your favorite uh, achievement uh, or challenge? Like, what, what's one that you really like? Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> There's so many of them. One of them was the Bosphorus. Yeah, one, yeah, one, one of them was the Bosphorus. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Any other ones that, like what's an example of one, so someone knows what, uh, what like what's a achievement? Achievement, it's some, some goal, special goal, for mm -hmm. example, distance, like yep. a Bosphorus race, it's uh, 6,500 meters, mm -hmm. and uh, you have to achieve this distance, and mm -hmm. then you complete this achievement. Mm -hmm. Is it for, you can do the 6.5 kilometers uh, in one workout or in multiple workouts, they add up to it? Uh, in this case, in yeah. one one workout. Uh huh. Uh huh. But some of the challenge, some of the achievements are different, like number of workouts or um, yeah, general, mm -hmm. general amount of something or distance or mm -hmm. workouts or I don't know. Yeah. So I, let's change change the topic. So I know you like to travel a lot. So what are some of your favorite? And you've traveled a lot of Europe. 
What are some of your favorite cities or countries or places that you've visited? Oh yeah, that's right. We travel a lot uh, by Europe with my girlfriend and now she's my wife and yeah. she's behind this camera right now. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we almost visited uh, 20 Europe countries. Wow. And it's always uh, some dilemma to what we choose to. Uh -huh. uh, it's like uh, to visit famous places in big cities yeah. or like a countryside, some special oh, sure. views. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we, we can recommend like, uh, for example, uh, Grindelwald. It's a really mm -hmm. small town in the, in the Switzerland mm -hmm. and really stunning views of mountains and also Liechtenstein, it's a very small country mm -hmm. uh, bordered by Switzerland and Austria mm -hmm. and also amazing nature and also we really like uh, Latvian beaches mm -hmm. uh, in the Baltic Sea and almost every year we are going and we like it because no people and just just the sounds uh, mm -hmm. from sea. Yeah, wow, beautiful. And I know you, you do these trips by car sometimes, uh, road trip, depending on how far it is. <laughs> yeah, a lot of uh, trips by car in Ukraine. Yeah. And uh, last year we went to Germany, rented mm -hmm. a car, and uh, we went uh, six, mm -hmm. six countries by mm -hmm. car. So Switzerland, Germany, Liechtenstein, Luxembourg, Italy, and Austria, I think. Mm -hmm. well, what's uh, going back to the work? What's it like being on a fully distributed team? You know, working with people all over the world, team members all over. Yeah, it's really exciting. It's, it's pretty cool because you know you can uh, find something new because very different people, different mm -hmm. time zones, different cultures, different mm -hmm. everything, mm -hmm. and if, if people really like what. Mm -hmm. They do. It's very simple to communicate and mm -hmm. do the best product. Yeah, yeah. And you're trilingual, speak Russian, Ukrainian, and English. Um, and we were featured in in, uh, in Russia and Ukraine two different times. So, well, I guess, what? How has it been to use different language skills on the team as well? Oh, it's it's really useful. <laughs> yeah. No, I, it's very cool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you understand some points from this country, some points from this yeah. country and to translate something to the team and yeah. back and it's really useful. No, it's been very cool. What, so what uh, What do you think of Istanbul? This is your first time in Istanbul, right? Yeah, it, it's a very cool city, but very busy. Very I mean, busy, yeah. Very, very big city. I've, I've never seen like a big city like this before. Mm, mm. Yeah, but it's really cool. Yeah, and what, what's been your favorite part of being in Istanbul so far? Uh, it, I've been only three days, so my Bosphorus race is my <laughs> favorite. The water. Yeah. <laughs> the water, the water, cool. What um, other hobbies that you have outside of swimming and programming? Uh, yeah, I, I cannot say that I have like a hobby, but mm -hmm. I played the guitar like yeah. um, five or seven years ago. Uh -huh. And I understand it's really difficult because you need a lot of practice mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. it's really hard working. And I understand I don't have time. And also, I want to learn a new language. And okay. Spanish, Spanish is a new, is the next one in my list, but it's also hard working. Yeah, okay, so Spanish. So in one year from now, we'll, we'll do this in Spanish? Nothing. In one, in, <coughs> in one year, in 12 months, I maybe hope. a little bit of Spanish? <laughs> maybe. Okay, okay. Maybe. I hope. Yes, yes, yes. Cool, well, um, thanks for joining me on the Ask a Swim Pro Show. Uh, this is really fun. We're here in Istanbul, Turkey. Uh, just finished the Bosphorus and uh, we'll catch you guys later. Bye. Bye.